Hey, you know, we've brought you stories of service industry employees hopeful they'll be back to work soon, filing now for unemployment. For many local businesses, though, the decision to temporarily lay off employees due to cutbacks to prevent COVID-19 has not been easy. And from one local business, these decisions are impacting an entire family. WAT 600 side reporter Madison Keevy joining us right now. So Madison, when it comes to a mom and pop shop, these last few weeks, I have to think, have been pretty personal. Absolutely, Bo. It's personal, it's emotional, and it's something really no family, no local business has wanted to go through, laying off employees that are part of their extended family. But at Gavino's Pizzeria, they're having to come to terms with that reality, even looking at pushing back retirement and postponing a wedding. Thursday lunches are really good. We'd probably have this whole back area full at our peak of lunch. That was a few weeks ago. Today, there's just not the same rush. Right now, our sales are probably at $100. Typically, they could end a lunch at $800. Gavino's Pizzeria in Bearden is takeout and delivery only. The staff today down to two. Jacqueline Bibby is the manager. Her family owns this location and Gavino's in Turkey Creek. I have let go of some of my best friends because we couldn't afford to have them here. Events like the yearly Turkey Bowl are part of Bibby's family and the extended Gavino's work family traditions, which makes the layoffs, cutbacks, and uncertainty more painful. My parents and I two weeks ago were talking about the retirement, and now we're just trying to talk about keeping this place up, you know? So, but they're really strong people, and they're been so good to everybody and trying to do everything they can and communicate with everybody, but it's just a toll. Bibby is engaged herself. Her wedding planned for next month now postponed, but she's choosing to focus on the good. Every person that calls, I appreciate it. And I really do want to make everything perfect for them and make sure they know that we do care for them. Gavinos says that they've opted to start doing takeout, alcohol delivery and pickup just to add something new to keep funds coming into the business and say that they talk to that group of employees that are more like family every day to keep them in the loop on what's going on, hopeful that they'll be opening sooner rather than later.